But when I saw her without arms was, she's very beautiful. She impresses me just with her personality, her beauty, and just the way she carries herself. The two got married, and like a lot of young couples, Barb and Mark began thinking about raising a family. But would Barb be able to handle all the responsibilities that come with raising a child? I had a lot of concern. I knew I could take care of them. I mean, I spent most of my teenage years babysitting other people's kids, so I knew I could. But I had never really taken care of a newborn 24-7. You know, it's rough. Did that tickle? There's nothing rough about this amazing young mom. She uses her incredible dexterity to handle the most delicate tasks with tender, loving care. I can pretty much do anything, just about anything with my feet that you can do with your hands. While Barb doesn't have time to dwell on her differences, most people can't seem to get over them. Even a night at the movies can turn into a challenge. Um, I get some strange reactions. Went to the movies and handed my ticket to the, to the guy, and he wouldn't even, didn't want to take it, because he didn't want to touch my foot. Barb has tried prosthetic arms, but found that they only get in her way. And while she's comfortable without them, there are special considerations when using your feet, like hands. If I'm going to be walking around outside and then I'm going to eat, of course I'm going to go wash my feet first. And now with taking care of her family and running a small business from home, Barb is busier than ever. And with all the incredible things that she can do, what's most remarkable is the fact that she's never once thought of giving up. I would just like to encourage other people if there's a will, there's a way. You don't have to sit on your desk and feel sorry for yourself. You can get out there and make something of yourself and live a full life just like anyone else. Look at that happy smile. Look at that happy smile.